just sit down. How you feel? Stronger, for sure. But not strong enough to work. Herr Morgan! Herr Morgan! Mr. Strauss? You busy, my friend? Why? I'll cut you in. Loaning? Already? You know how it is. People is happy to borrow off someone like me, but more enthusiastic paying back to someone like you. Of course. Who are they? Hmm, let me see. A Chick Matthews works at Guthrie Farm. He's a hand, I believe. Mr. Robel, the small holder at Painted Sky. Runs the operations there badly. Miss Lily Millet is a ranch maid up at Emerald Ranch. And here was me believing Dutch's bluster about us helping folk. It's legal work, Mr. Morgan. Debtors belong in prison. We are doing them a favor. Ah, I'll make sure they see it in them terms. Put the debts in the deed box and try not to kill them. It's very bad for business. I just miss it. So, Arthur, when I was in Valentine, nosing about, I think I found something interesting. What's that, Tilly? Well, I'm not exactly sure. Something about the doctor's office. There's something funny going on there. Saw a bunch of nasty boys going in and none of them coming out. Hmm. Thank you. Maybe I'll go take a look. Anything else? No. Just that. Well, keep looking. Will do. How are you? Covered from that business in the hotel? Oh, yeah. So we gonna hit that bank I told you about? We'll see. Mr. Morgan, you seem chipper. But where there's life. I killed girls that betrayed us. And they're the happy. Trading betrayal in your world, Miss Grimshaw? Not reading this. I don't know. Idleness is betrayal because it means I work so you don't have to. That's not partner come take a look at this look at this my friend tobacco nature's gift to us all hmm. focuses the mind like nothing else 
Whatever you say. Well, I say, why buy it off the shelves when you can make your own? Well, plenty left here if you're interested. I'd best keep moving. Knock, knock, Mr. Robe. No, przepraszam, co pan robi w moim domu? God damn it. English? Me, uh, um, Silesia. Yeah, good uh, for you. Silesia. I'm here for money. Do you borrow from a German man? Aha, uh, German. Uh, um, uh, mein Herr, uh, uh, sprechen das, uh, this, uh, uh, the nah, Kaiserreich. I don't ja? speak German neither. I'm here for money. Money. That you borrowed from Leopold Strauss. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Uh, Leopold Strauss. Uh huh. Yeah. So it's time to pay. Where is it? Oh, well, no, I have nothing. Is very bad winter. We've all had a bad winter, pal. <laughs> Where is Oh, no. No, nie, nie. Now, you remember where you're keeping that silver? Potrzebuję trochę czasu, znajdę ci pieniądze. Oh, still don't understand you. God damn it, you have a debt to hair straps. Pay up. Stop! You still mam siły. You still mam siły. Just time. Yeah. Yeah. No. No. Yeah. No. Oh, no. It's good. It's good. It's valuable. It's. It's Warsaw. Yes. I have your things. Okay. I have anything in here or out there. Yes. The longer I look, the madder I get. It's very valuable. Good? Not good yet. Better be something somewhere. Don't even speak English. Must 
come here with something. Yes, yes. What you got behind there? So, uh, surprise, I mean, near me. Move aside. Rusakom nie można ufać. Amerykańcom też. What do we have here? Moja obrączka, nie! Just keep quiet. Okay. That should about cover oh. things. Yep. Okay, 
Hey there. How did you get on, Herr Morgan? Called in on the small holder, Robo. Didn't even speak English. <laughs> good, very good. My pleasure. Uh, well, if it's pleasure you're after, there is one other. This farmer preacher fellow I met in Valentine, Mr. Downs. The opinionated little do-gooder? Yeah, I know the one. I certainly know the type. Thank you, Herr Morgan. There's no need to thank me. Like you said, it's pleasure I'm after. He's more slippery than he seems. I've tried being polite. Don't take any nonsense. Nonsense? Me? If he doesn't have the money, beat him. Well, I usually do. I know. I know.
Ah, I hope you ain't looking for gold, partner. I ain't seen so much as a fleck round here. <laughs> All right, here we go. Here we go. Hey, give me some goddamn space here, will you? Just curious is all. No need to get rattled. like another pile of shit crumbs, don't it? Look what we got here! <laughs> ah! Oh, Jiminy Cockpickers! I need assistance! Dang it! So, what you got for me? do you want? Mr. Thomas Downs? You owe me money. Uh, oh, no, no, I'm, I'm, I'm... We ain't a charity, Mr. Downs. I said I would get the money, and I will. Just, I can't for a while. Really? Certainly, would you? Oh, please. I have a family, sir. Please. I don't care about your family. Why'd it have to come to this, huh? If I'm here, there's a reason I'm here. A little patience is all I require. <laughs> You ain't such a do-gooder, are you? If you're running out on debts... I'm... I'm not running anywhere. I'm... 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 Be reasonable! <laughs> you borrowed money from my business partner, Herr Strauss. You owe him, you took the money. He wants it back, what's not to understand? <laughs> Where's our money? I don't have it. Sell your place. We already owe more than it's worth. <coughs> then sell your wife, or your family, or something. 
We ain't your idea of charity. Is that clear? <coughs> Thomas! What are you looking at? Thomas! I said what you looking at, woman. My husband isn't well. If we could just have more... Like I said, we ain't nobody's idea of charity. Get us the money. Ah, how did you get on? Not so good. He's almost dead. And they seem more or less destitute. You were a fool for lending them the money. Well, people who aren't desperate don't seem so interested in my propositions. Of course. <laughs> <laughs> 